Okay, let me tell you what Lamp is going has been spending time on. Look, that is the new way she's arranging stuff. Baby, the new way to do things. Now, since I have more time, I thought I should help you with your closet. It's organized in a way that you can easily find them. And there's more space. What does that mean? Everything you haven't worn in the past six months is out of the cup of jar. How many days? Three days of uh, quarantine. <laughs> yes, look at my hair. It's actually half done because I was like just really bored and I thought I should make my hair in these small chunks. And now we want to go out. I don't know where we're going to because I think pretty much all the shops are closed. But we just really want to get out of the house. I think we're probably to, going to drive maybe two, three, four kilometers and just come back home. <laughs> we are um, on the road to I don't know where. I've been actually just thinking this is the longest time we have been together in, in our apartment. Yes. When we got this apartment we knew it was extremely small but we're like we're never at home we're always traveling when we are free and then now we're probably going to be in there for two weeks or even six weeks. My goodness. I'm like and I've been get messy so quickly. Yeah, but for me mess is not the point. It's just too small. I'm not even used to being at home. Happy that I have we have YouTube now because I would have been probably driving you crazy. Mm -hmm. For you it's pretty much business as usual. You can still work as usual. But yeah. for me it's completely different. So yeah. <clears throat> the streets are quite empty. Yeah, yeah they are. there are very, very few people on the roads, also few cars few bicycles mm -hmm. it's it's a difficult situation I should say like I can't even remember last time I slept eight hours in, I know. in the night because usually we sleep like five or maybe like maximum six but now like this is you're not a bicycle baby where are you going oh really I'm not a bicycle <laughs> thank you <laughs> Unfortunately, that is the situation uh, in the shops uh, actually in Germany. There's scarcity of primary resources like bread, uh, pasta, uh, potatoes, uh, of course toilet paper, and uh, of course disinfectant and mask. It's really difficult to find that. something like that like this thank mm -hmm. you it's been a long, very long time when last you had breakfast in bed <laughs> i would say four cups so what did you have for breakfast mandarin tomato some bread with marmalade and a rose You know, for us, there isn't so much as mm. to home. And one of the things you can do is just learn something together. Oh, oh. Other things to do is really just to take a self-care moment or time to enjoy yourself as a couple, get in the bathtub and enjoy 30 minutes of just your body soaking in the water infused with nice essential oil as well as mineral salts. Just thought we should check in to see how you guys are doing in quarantine time yes. for us. Stay at home guys, stay at home. It, it is serious out there. It's stay at home depending on if your country allow you to stay at home but I think most countries now we know they allow people to stay at home absolutely amazing we have been in, at home for this is day 14 mm -hmm. it's becoming very very stressful to be at home thinking of we've eaten too much we're now eating well. in and quarantine we getting fed. <laughs> absolutely especially with what are you what are you making no, uh, it's the broth because uh, oh, okay. it's kind of stuck in the in the jar. So it's always moist. Yeah, it's always moist. And 
So we are making risotto. We are making a risotto with uh, fennel puree. Fennel puree, yeah, mm -hmm. and parmigiano. Is this your invention? Yeah, an invention also because look at our fridge. <laughs> that is after ten days of uh, just being at home. We just we don't have anything apart from butter, eggs, and then some fruits. So the only fresh, uh, fresh vegetable that we still had was this fennel that was <laughs> kind of dying in the fridge, and we decided to you know, try some out something with it. Way, way too much. No bad. In the, in the first week it was no bad, but we now it's becoming exercising. really bad. It's not. We can't, we are not exercising. Few things, we, like um, here at home, like just stretching and so on the bed or on the couch. This is what I have to say. The first week I didn't feel so much pressure because I'm like, okay, I can actually sleep for a week. First week away from work. Then second week it became a little bit more stressful. Like now, what do we do at home? We have 40 square meter apartment and we got this because we always been traveling whenever we were free. Now we're here for two weeks without going pretty much anywhere other than going to the supermarket or just a short walk in the park. But that too is becoming very, very scary. Two days ago when I went to the supermarket, mm -hmm. a guy was walking just towards me and somewhere close to me, he sneezed. So my reaction was really like, huh? ah, <laughs> I jumped and ran. Yeah, it's, it's terrible. It's terrible. So it's becoming very scary. The past few days, we just usually go for a short drive, like 10 minutes, just around the, 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 the farms around our area. And then we come back. Without even getting out. Yeah, of the without car. getting out of the car. But we somehow to have to get out of this apartment because we literally just have an office. And yeah, now Bubuchino is making lunch. We've been yeah, eating check, check. three meals a day. Bono, like our apartment is not in order at the moment. It's very stressful to keep this apartment in order when you're at home all the time. 40 square meter, two people. It's just very difficult. So yeah. been literally just here from morning to evening watching TV, doing some work if we have something to do, reading some cookbook and of course always in front of tv and my working table which i usually just i try to do especially my actual work which is now monday to friday that's when i sit here and do like real work like the job that pays the bill <laughs> you know with a quarantine time we're spending all the time together there's just a whole lot of time to argue about everything like this hard drive thing yeah, it's it not my there. fault at all. Absolutely no. It was the other hard drive was yes, on your baby, bench. You're right. It's my fault. <laughs> and this corona thing, it's also not my fault. Oh, so that's how you exercise now? Yeah, I see. We really miss our gym. It's not bad. It's not bad. Mm. So let mm. me go check on my risotto. I think the really challenge of being quarantined for outdoor couples like that is like us is like we don't have plans today when I woke up I was feeling a little bit like okay Sunday morning usually we would go for a brunch but we can't go for a brunch everything is closed so literally at the moment like for a Sunday we don't have any plan apart from wake up have breakfast sleep uh, watch TV and eat risotto eat risotto <laughs> yes then on, on, on working days, obviously, we have uh, normal work, but today, in particular, we don't have anything to do, I really... Studying. Studying is always there. I have to some stuff to read. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I also want to learn how to use the drone. But we'll see. Because yesterday when we went outside, there were people already patrolling if people are outside. So we'll see if we... This coming week, we are, we are allowed, yeah, to, go allowed to, to go to the field. And... But if, you know, I'm thinking if people are not allowed to go to the field, it's going to be very problematic. Yes. You know why? Especially if it's good weather. I mean, no, it's not weather. about good weather. If you own a dog. No, on a dog, of course, you you are allowed. Otherwise, no. what do you do? Yes, no. you are. In Italy, you are. If you have, if you own a dog, you can go still go out. Ah, uh, only if you own a dog, you are allowed to go out. Yes. Oh, okay. if you have like some. Uh, some work uh, in a sense that you are working for the hospital and you need yeah, to Yeah, that, of course that is uh, it's not even I think in every country all the nurses doctors are allowed to go to work and also other important people like firefighters and police officers 
Ever think we can have a dog because probably this year we're not going to travel. Oh, with garnish. Super. How amazing this way. I'm Some in tea. love with you. Some the TV. Mm -hmm. Bad behavior. quarantine <laughs> behavior. I'm just taking a small portion in case it's not good. <laughs> I trust you though. I don't know it's going to be good. It's good. It's good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So this experiment rated one to ten. Lampy approval. Lampy approval. Give me a lampy approval. But one to ten, I'll give it. I will give it an eight. Okay, that's that's a good mark. Actually, I'm satisfied. But I think this is something we're never able to because two is gone. Why? In my opinion, the rice is undercooked, but you always like the rice this crunchy. No, a little bit more. Like I need to still feel the the grain of the of the thingy. Otherwise, I don't know. It's just porridge. Just ah, anyway, guys. Pretty much that's day fourteen of being at home. Wishing you all a beautiful week ahead. Yeah. Stay strong, stay at home, stay safe. Most important, stay positive. Stay positive. Positive. Yes. Like, it is difficult. I also keep praying for a relationship that our marriage survive the current era, like, period or season because we never spend so much time. It's like you, you have one room, two of you working in one room all the time. Yep. It's like marriage at first sight. No, like <laughs> you're 24 7 just finding problems in your you know about your partner because you're looking at each other 24 7, seven.